are you? How are you feeling this morning? Are you feeling all better? All right. Well, why don't we hop into our chores? Hello buns, welcome back to Cinnabon Sundays. Today I figured I would do a nice little day in the life vlog because it is just a kind of just gross and rainy day and typically days like this I am so just not motivated to do anything but this morning I told myself I was going to wake up have myself a nice cozy morning that you guys got to see flashes of just to make this day a little bit less dreary and a little more fun. I haven't done just like a day in the life vlog in like over a month or so, so I figured it was time for us to hang out together. I'm trying to think of any big updates that I have. Probably our biggest update is that Cinnabon, after like a seven month stint with no stasis, she had a tiny little bout of stasis last week. If you guys follow our Instagram, you would already know all about it. I tried really hard to share a lot about our experience. I caught it super, super early. So within a few hours of her medication and treatment, she was completely back to normal and she's doing great. I'll show you in just a second how she's doing. So that's really our only like Cinnabon update that's been going on. And as far as me, I'm also no huge updates either. I feel like from the months of January to March, I just like hibernate and then once summer hits, I become another human, you know? But the things that I do need to get done today, Easter is this weekend, and so I have a couple of Easter bunny tasks that I need to do. Bryant and I, yes, we're 30 years old, but we still give each other Easter baskets. It's like my favorite tradition ever. I think it's so cute. We make little baskets for each other and we hide them around the house, and obviously I make one for Cinnabon as well. So I need to go get a couple of goodies for his basket. I am working on a home renovation, a very small one, and when I say I'm working on it, I mean I'm working on hiring people to do it. We're gonna do a little like bedroom and bathroom refresh, which I'm really excited about. And then lastly, I am working on a secret Cinnabon project and I hate being that YouTuber that's like, I have a secret project, but I do. It's something that Bryant and I have been working on for quite a while and I'm hoping that soon you'll know what it is, but I have a couple things I need to get done for that as well. So just something to keep you, keep you on your toes. Let's check on Cinnabon Hangout and I can also show you the stuff I want to do to my bedroom. So here's the little fluff monster. Hello. Say hi, Cinnabon. Come say hello. Okay, well, she's doing great. <laughs> Very normal Cinnabon behavior. But the way that I knew last week that Cinnabon was not feeling well, so I always give Cinnabon just a little bit of forage just in the middle of the day as kind of like a lunchtime treat. And last week I went to get her forage and she didn't want any, which you can see she's very, very invested in her little pieces that she just got. And so that was my first sign of like, oh, that's not normal. And really I know Cinnabon so well, let's put the rest on her mat. She can come get it when she's done chewing over there. But I know Cinnabon so well that if she refuses any snack whatsoever, <laughs> that's not normal. So I was able to jump into action. But like I said, she's doing great, feeling much better. Cinnabon, it's over on your mat. See, there we go. But yeah, she's doing great, back to normal. And again, I posted literally everything about that bout of stasis on her Instagram and I have it under a highlight. And I thought it would just be helpful to like really show signs of Cinnabon being in stasis in the early signs. So you know what to look for. So I have videos about it here, but if you're looking for something really quick, I'm gonna keep that highlight on Instagram. I have just been craving a little bit of an upgrade to our room, to our house. I've actually done little like room renovations on here before, but here is what we're wanting to do. This is mine and Bryant's bedroom, our master bedroom, and I love it. I think it's beautiful, but I just feel like we can make it way better. So our plan is we are going to paint the walls. I haven't decided on a color yet, but what I wanna do is wallpaper this bathroom. Hello. I wanna put wallpaper on just like the walls in here, and I haven't decided the wallpaper yet, but it'll probably be like a blue or green type of pattern. I don't know, just some kind of neutral that I love. Our house has a lot of blues and greens in it. And then pull a color from that wallpaper and paint the walls in here. And then we are going to bring the hardwoods that are in here into this room, just cause this carpet is just like so dark and gray and kind of dingy. 
and then we're replacing this rug with a black and white rug that my mom actually already has and is going to give to us. So that's kind of the vision for in here. And I just feel like a fresh coat of paint makes such a difference, like such a big difference in a space. And I think that it's just going to completely revamp everything. So I'm going to make some calls today to try to get some quotes and I'll keep you guys updated. It'll probably be a little bit of a long process, but we're in the early stages. I'm now going to set my camera down and do a little time lapse because I just have some computer work to do, working on, you know, my secret project and sending some emails about the home re reno renovation. It's not a renovation, it's like a refresh. So let's just do a quick little time lapse of that. Also, anytime I'm working, this is what's underneath me. Hello. Oh, oh no, she really likes to chew. She's been really into chewing on these slippers. Let me show you. They have like a styrofoam bit on them and she's been really interested in chewing my shoes. She's not normally a shoe chewer, but something about the bunny slippers, she really likes them. because he doesn't take, or he takes his wedding ring off. What's her name? It's uh, Megathump. Megathump the bunny. But he says that she likes to wear it as an earring. That's right. You don't have anything to say? No. Oh, are you shy? Yes. Oh, uh, the Easter bunny has some errands they need to run. Oh, Goodbye. Bye. Okay, so I got in my car. I did it. We are going to go to World Market and there's a Walgreens right next door. I just feel like World Market is the best place to go for just like cutesy little basket fillers. Like they just have the best stuff and they're such a good price. So I feel like that's the perfect place to go for little filler items. Like Bryant's main thing I'm putting in his basket is a Lululemon sweatshirt. He loves anything for Lululemon. So that I got him that, but you gotta have like snackies and accessories and then Walgreens. I can just get him like an Easter bunny. <laughs> so that's my plan. Let's go see if there's any cute bunny stuff. Cause I'm sure there is. So I went shopping, but they were playing music that would get me demonetized. So here are some bunny items. How cute. Okay. Back to the car. Okay, got myself a little haul. I'm excited. I'll show y'all what I got. So I kind of went like a theme of things that remind me of trips we've gone on a little bit and then also just some of his favorite things. So I got him these. I've never had these before. Um, at World Market, they sell snacks from like other countries and Brian and I are going to London this summer. So this is something like from London and I've never tried them and they seemed interesting. It's like peppermint bubble chocolate things. If you've had these, let me know if they're good. I got him also these chocolate chip macadamia cookies from Hawaii. Our first vacation ever together was in Hawaii, so made sense. And then also another thing from um, like the UK, these Kit Kat chunky things. I think it's so cool how there are just so many better Kit Kats like everywhere besides the United States. So I got these, I thought these were cool and like, I don't know if they're fun. At Walgreens, I got him not one, not two, not three, it was the last one, four. Four of these Altoids mints. This is like his addiction. He loves mints. We get in the car and he immediately grabs the mints and eats like 10 of them. So I got him four containers. His favorite candy ever are Jelly Belly Jelly Beans. So I got him those. Got him these little mini Easter bunnies. I wanted to find him like a Lindor or a Lint dark chocolate, but they didn't have any. So I figured I would get him the small ones because I feel like as much as I love the big Easter bunnies, they're not, they're just like harder to eat. So these are cute. I got him the Haribo Cola gummies because when we were in Sicily this year, he, I told him to like go get snacks and like that's what he came back with, which I thought was really weird, but I thought a cute memory. So I thought it was nice, like snackies, but pretty much all of them have like some kind of connection to like us and the places we've gone and the places we're going that's that that's my little easter basket haul hope you enjoyed and now it's time to get home Ooh, let's try this transition it's time to go home because it's dinner time dinner time it's little bunny dinner time little bunny dinner little bunny dinner little tiny bunny dinner yum there are a few things cuter than a rabbit chewing like look at that thing hi all right, well, Bryant and I are off to dinner to meet my parents. So I'm gonna go ahead and shut Cinnabon. There she is, I gave her some forage, even though she literally just had dinner, but 
She needed something to get her into her room. So I'm going to shut Cinnabon into her room. And buns, that is where I'm going to end the vlog today. I hope you enjoyed just spending a very normal, cozy, rainy day with me. We've been doing a lot of um, just how-to videos on this channel and revisiting some content that we made years ago. So I hope that you enjoyed just a little vlog in between just to see what me and Cinnabon are up to. I also just like miss talking to you guys. So let me know if you like these vlogs, if you like this content, and I'll see you in our next video. Bye, buns. Before you go, here is a fun moment between CB and Bryant. Will you scratch her? Why is it that you can bother her so much and I can't? <laughs> that was very cute. She is obsessed with you. Good job, where are you leaving? Don't keep playing.